the feeling in the room is very much like a family and it really does feel like coming home and being with your tribe. It's really been such a special process because we remember what our bodies used to do. I was putting the puzzle back together and every day it feels stronger and better and my body is okay and I can push myself and I, I can dance again. <laughs> I'd really love to see Fee out there looking exquisite dancing with Adam Bull. I mean, that's just to die for. And Kirsty and Steve doing the pas de deux that they do. I mean, Simon Dow, who I remember as a principal when I was at the ballet school. Then you've got Madeleine Isto and Leanne Stoymanoff. And Jessica too, who, you know, was such a beautiful dancer and looking as if she never stopped. Paul Knobloch, who had a, a career here with the Australian Ballet and then overseas. But there's that, that kind of varied scale of ages, experience, and everyone has their own journey and we're all in it together. But it's exciting, we all clap and cheer to each other and each time a movement finishes or it was a guest dancing with a company member, everyone's cheering and supportive. And The fact that it is a complete work of art, you know, Christopher Gordon's score is so beautiful and emotive and John's visual design is just amazing. The costumes are so beautiful and so flattering. But I think Alice has just brought so much so much imagery to life from previous productions in very subtle ways that, you know, st it's still her choreography and it's fresh. But there's a, there's a real feeling of nostalgia and in a beautiful way. Coming into rehearsal was a little bit unknown, I have to say, when we started at the Opera House, because you didn't know what the steps were going to be. You didn't know how difficult or how physical. She didn't know either. Alice didn't know how physical we were able to be with ourselves. And then it was just that little process of bit by bit, class day by day, um, as I said, making sure the steps felt nice, looked nice, and then layering. So that was the process of going, oh my goodness, um, what, what an honor to be, you know, to be asked for one thing, but then I was really like it. something that I'm proud of and something that I'm representing the company for. There must be four or 500 dancers who have been through the company and I feel like in a way, us former dancers, you know, we are representing all of them. This is about us as a company, as an art form, and just as a, you know, as a group of artists. And that's what's so beautiful about it.